Please briefly introduce yourself. Hi guys, my name is Frances Harley. I'm the CEO of Pretty Perfect Minks. Okay, okay. And so your company is Pretty Perfect Minks. What type of business is it? So I currently sell mink lashes and edge control. I'm currently working on a cosmetic line, so lipsticks and lip glosses, and also a hair extension line. Okay, girl. <laughs> Look. <laughs> So, what is Pretty Perfect Mink's mission and purpose? Okay, so when you think about cosmetic things, you may think that it's to make you feel better or to to just make you look better. But in all honesty, every woman is beautiful. And so, that's a natural, you're naturally beautiful. And just wearing your extra lashes, that's just to give you an extra dose of confidence. It's not to take away from your natural beauty. And so when you think about it, you just want to feel amazing. You want to feel flawless. You want to feel like your best you when you wear Pretty Perfect Minks. Okay, okay. So what inspired you to start your business? So I've always wanted to start my own business. I've always had the hustler mindset in high school. Um, I started selling candy. That was like my first little thing to make money on the side. Then I started working. And from there, I've always worked and kept a job just to like stay. I love money. <laughs> so, I mean, who doesn't? But I've always known that I had the leadership skills to run something myself. So I wanted to own my own restaurant. But I just wanted to start with lashes and hair because that's just to get my foot in the door to have something of my own. And I'm really young, so I still have lots of opportunities to still make all those dreams come true. Okay, okay. Now, out of all the mink lash businesses and cosmetic businesses out there, what sets your business apart from other businesses that are similar to yours? So I feel like customer service is the biggest part. Customer service will make or break your business. And I feel like my myself and my company have really made an impact on my customers. Um, whenever somebody orders from my website, if they're a friend, family, you still have to treat them as if they will never meet you. So you want to make sure that everything is on point. I try to make sure that any time that shipping will be guaranteed in two days i try to always make sure i send out tracking numbers i guarantee that i check with my customers to make sure they have received their products i also check back with them for feedback and to just also um, ask them about their overall experience with my company and that makes people feel good about shopping with you and supporting your brand and they won't forget how you made them feel so just being friendly as well makes a big impact on your customers okay okay now would you say your business has a relationship with the community yes i'm also just trying to um reach out more to the community um provide more community service events uh, starting this year, I'm hosting a prom dress drive-in giveaway. So I have an event called Say Yes to the Dress. I'm currently um, asking people for donations of their old prom dresses, homecoming dresses. And on March 3rd, I'll be gathering high school seniors um, who'll be going to prom and maybe their parents can't afford to get them a dress or maybe it's just too expensive. Um, I'll be donating and giving away all the dresses that I've collected. So that is going to be my first community service project that I put on by myself. And I'm really excited because I just feel like if you are blessed, you have to bless others. And that's been my whole motto for this um, community service project. If you're a blessing, be a blessing to others. So if you are interested in donating a dress, you can email me at prettyperfminx at gmail.com. And we can set up a time where you can drop off your dress or if you would just like to be at the event. Great, great. I like that. 
Now, when it comes to your business, what's more important? Creating and delivering a great, a great quality product for your customer or just the overall customer's happiness and satisfaction? So Pretty Perfect Mink strives to deliver quality products each time. So with um, offering quality products, you're guaranteed to get a satisfied customer. Um, when people spend their money and they actually enjoy the product, they like the product, it's quality and everything that you said would happen like let's say, for example my lashes are supposed to last 20 to 25 uses oftentimes people are like oh no they're not they're they're not gonna last that long but when you they actually buy the lashes and they last for a long time they don't come off they don't get stiff people are really excited and they're always willing to shop with you and support you so giving quality products will always guarantee a satisfied customer So, what is it about Mink Lashes that falls in line with beauty and confidence? So, Mink Lashes is just the extra. Sometimes you don't want to do a full face of makeup. Sometimes you don't want to have to, um, you know, sometimes I don't even do my hair. I just put on my lashes and I still will catch looks like I'm going to be the center of attention because my lashes are glamorous. I'm, my lashes make me feel flawless. My lashes give me confidence. So just simply having that extra confidence gives you something more about yourself. Like you, you stand out. You truly stand out and you're always going to get compliments. Trust me. Okay, so what's one thing that you've learned that you would like to share with others? One thing I've learned is to just keep a positive outlook. Um, entrepreneurship is not easy so you truly will face so many struggles and you have to keep a positive outlook um, with just keeping a positive outlook means knowing that things will happen things will fall through things will not go as planned but you still have to say wow you know today I I did this today I accomplished this something in my life happened today that was positive I can't be mad about what didn't happen what I couldn't control things of that nature and that honestly gets you through your day and people will feed off that positive energy Now, Inspire, Empower, Uplift is the slogan of the Black Maverick. So do you have any encouraging words that you would like to share with the black community? Okay, I feel like you have to inspire others. You have to uplift others. When you see people doing good in your community, you have to tell them congratulations. You have to say, you're doing good. I'm proud of you. Like, those are comments that you think are small to you but they people are watching people are looking for those comments people sometimes just need that extra um compassion from somebody else and that just helps them get through their day as an entrepreneur hearing somebody tell me i'm so proud of you or keep it up or i see you working those type of comments truly make me smile and i know that it can do the same thing for anybody else so you just want to always inspire others to do better uplift others when they're down or uplift others when you see that they're doing something positive and just be a role model be an inspiration all right guys i'm francis harley ceo of pretty perfect minks i'm the ceo and owner um you can follow my business page at pretty perf minks p-r-e-t-t-y p-e-r-f-m-i-n-k-s and on Facebook, you can like and share, same name. The website is www.prettyperfectminks.com. Really simple. You start typing it in Google and you'll find it. Um, you can also follow me on Instagram at underscore Sanfran the Lash Fairy. So just um, stay tuned for more to come from me and my company. Also, if you're interested in participating in the Say Yes to the Address event, make sure you contact me. I'm available through email or on my Instagram pages. You can let me know that you want to donate a dress or you know somebody who needs a dress for prom. The event is March 3rd. That's the day that we'll actually be giving away the prom dresses. And I am collecting um, dresses all throughout the Atlanta area, all the way up until the day of the event. So please make sure you get back with me if you want to be a part of this dope event.